We were trying to figure out a way to generate resources for Wolf Tree, and we came up with the idea of the Wolf Tree Challenge as a way to connect the community with what actually Wolf Tree does. So the way to do that to us was to actually put people into a Wolf Tree classroom. Yeah. Well, you put your on to the you can start practicing right now. When we were walking down the hill, we saw evidence of fire, and then we saw that they were putting down brush and debris and piles, so we're guessing that they um, are doing fire prevention. And then I also noted that there's junipers along the riparian zone here and that there was a pondero young ponderosa grove coming down the hill. Then I was going to make a note on the geology as well. Our items that are outlined in your forms, which are like doing some journaling. These items are for viewing. Um, you can kind of suck them up out of your, your bin here and put them into the different um, trays and that way you can view them and identify them and sketch them and do all those wonderful things. Yes, eight's the smallest. The Wolf Tree believes if you're going to teach a kid about a stream, that you put them in a pair of hip waders and you put them out in the middle of that stream and you let them ask the questions and find the answers themselves. Project-based learning. And then you'll, you'll see, we pulled the core the other, out. These other ones. Which are done yellow. This is a core, and I got it out of the tree by pulling it. If we were able to go and take a device and stick it in there and cross over all the wood, we would bring up all the rings that are formed every year on the tree. We would be able to see those, and every year a ring is made, we would be able to find out what the age was. Four. Four. Five, six, fifty-seven. Yeah. So when the challenge is over, we gathered at Aspen Lakes. We had a silent auction and a live auction, and the kids and the families who were all there were celebrated with awards. They were judged on creativity, on correct answers, on uh, outside the box thinking, and working in teams. Incredible, incredible job and in incumbent boring the tree. So, uh, congratulations, you guys. It has been an incredible experience for anybody who is involved in it. They learned a lot about themselves, they learned a lot about their families, they learned how to work in groups, and they learned certainly a lot about science. There's a little um, vial for... Science literacy in this day and age is so important and so vital. We need this educated workforce to come into this next decade, and this is what Wolf Tree does. Bye.